Pharmacy is a challenging and rewarding profession that has developed into one of the health industry's most important patient care roles, ensuring the best medication to manage illness and promote good health. The role of a pharmacist encompasses uh, providing uh, information and advice on medications. Uh, after all, pharmacists are medication experts and that is our, our, our craft, our profession. And so we spend our whole time working with medications, um, studying medications and their best use within our patients. Every day is slightly different. I have one day every week where I'm out, out and about in people's homes doing home medicines reviews. I also visit nursing homes and review the charts and medications of the patients in, uh, in the nursing home. And when I'm back at the pharmacy, it's very much uh, to do with counselling. Uh, dispensing the prescriptions, checking uh, dosages, any contraindications, making sure the medication is suitable for who it's being prescribed for. We liaise closely with our local general practitioners and specialists as well. And um, we do, we seem to do a lot more health promotion too, which is a really interesting part of pharmacy. And probably the, one of the most rewarding parts for me is about disease prevention and managing uh, the prevention of chronic disease states within Australia. Pharmacy is a great career. Uh, I like it particularly because there's so many variety of tasks that we can do on a day-to-day -day basis. We can be at someone's home doing a home medicines reviews, we could be visiting hospitals or nursing homes, or we could be in a community pharmacy where we're providing advice or information. At the end of the day, um, the best part about it for me is helping someone and is providing uh, care and advice to someone which makes their life so much better. Um, the remuneration is, is, is really quite good. Uh, so Graduates after their 48 week registration period uh, can be employed from about $65,000 and upwards, depending on the hours they work, uh, the range of tasks and responsibilities they're doing and uh, the environment in which they're working as well. You can also get more money by becoming an accredited consultant pharmacist, which is doing the home medicines reviews or medication reviews in nursing homes. The education requirements to become a pharmacist is you need a relatively high mark from the end of grade 12 and it's compulsory that you've also studied uh, Mathematics B, English and Chemistry, which should give you the prerequisites uh, to entry into the Bachelor of Pharmacy program at the University of Queensland. The personal attributes required to be a good pharmacist are sound communication skills. So that's both verbal and written communication skills. Being able to listen to someone and provide them with advice on the spot, uh, you need to be very good at problem solving and uh, to be able to, to utilise the, the information you've gained over your education and also it's lifelong education as well, it's a very important point um, to be able to provide that information and advice to your consumers. Um, you also need to be a very caring person, very empathetic and um, we're working in a team all the time so whether that's a team in your individual community pharmacy or whether it's a team of colleagues with hospital, uh, in hospitals such as with doctors nurses and other allied health professions, it's very important that you're an effective team player as well. I chose to study at UQ because of the good reputation that the university as a whole has and, and also the School of Pharmacy has as well. The School of Pharmacy here at UQ has very close ties with other leading national universities and also other international universities and pharmacy facilities as well. And also with our teaching hospitals around Brisbane and around Queensland. The lecturers here at UQ uh, were fantastic. Life on campus is just amazing. You really don't have to leave St. Lucia. Uh, there's, it's a working community. We have our own pharmacy, lolly shops. And since starting here, I've found out all the different teaching awards that my lecturers have actually won, including, say, Clinical Pharmacist of the Year. We will, the School of Pharmacy will actually be moving to the Pharmacy Australia Centre of Excellence that's based at the um, Princess Alexandra Hospital and that should be moving in 2009 or 10 and that furthers our um, world-class research and um, pharmacists from all over the country and internationally will be looking to study there. UQ's Bachelor of Pharmacy provides leading education and excellent job opportunities for a career at the cutting edge of health delivery. To find out more about studying health at UQ, visit UQ's study website, uq.edu.au forward slash study and click on health.